Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having an amazing day. In today's video, we will be going shopping for Christmas decorations for both the bunny rooms and the hamster cage. I plan on going to TJ Maxx, Hobby Lobby, Five Below, Dollar Tree, maybe like PetSmart and Petco. So it's gonna be a lot of fun. This video will only include shopping for their Christmas decorations, but if you actually wanna see me decorate the rabbit rooms and the hamster cage, make sure you're subscribed and stay tuned for that video. Now before we actually go shopping, I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys an overview of the rabbit rooms and the hamster cage and what Christmas decorations I already have from last year. So let's go ahead and get straight into this video. This is the Foster Buns setup right now. You can see they still have their Halloween cat cardboard house. They love that thing. It's already kind of destroyed on the inside. You can't see it from this angle. If I was just over there munching hay. So I was thinking of putting this smaller Christmas tree that I have right here in the corner because they can't get to that corner. So I feel like it'd be a really good place to put a Christmas tree in their room. So that's kind of my idea for here. Obviously we could hang up some garland around the outside. Yeah, I have some really cool ideas and I do actually have fleece for in here. Um, yeah. So here's Oreo's cage. You can see I have not taken down the decorations from Halloween yet. I actually just cleaned her cage last week but I didn't actually take the decorations down. So this is her enclosure. So I'm gonna do kind of the same thing, but Christmas themed and do like Christmas wallpaper. And I think it's gonna look really cool. Hopefully I can find some safe hamster products to actually put inside the cage as well. So this is my entire rabbit set up here, their little play area and then their main enclosure. So I'm for sure gonna do like Christmas fleece. I was thinking I could string lights on the outside so they can't get to it so it'd be okay for them so yeah we have a lot of room here to decorate so these are kind of still in this tote here but we have these like christmas cat houses that we can put in their play area i actually have two of them stuffed in here so it's one thing we have to decorate as for other decorations i have a ton of christmas lights in this tote i'm not going to bring it down right now but there's a lot of christmas lights that i can use and then down here we have our Christmas tree tote. Um, right now, all I have in it is this smaller Christmas tree that I have. It's about four or five feet tall and it's pretty skinny. So this is the tree I was thinking about putting in the Foster Buns room. I'm not gonna pull it out right now, but it's in there. So this is the last of the decorations. We have some cut out snowflakes. We have like two garlands here. So we definitely need more garland. We have like one thing of uh, ornaments. In here is a little Christmas tree, probably about a foot tall, I would say. Then we have all of their stockings. I have four here, so probably need to get one more, maybe like a small one for Oreo. Got this cute little ornament. This is the tree skirt for that tree. These are the ornaments for this tree. Oh, and we have another thing of those same ornaments. So. This is mainly what I used last year to decorate the rabbit cage. So we're gonna expand on this and make it even more Christmassy. Let's move the Halloween stuff out of the way. We have some Christmas fleece that I used last year and I'll be using this again in my personal buns room. Last but not least, we have this Christmas fleece, which I think is really cool. Like flamingos and Santa hats and lemons and watermelon, Santa on a floaty. This fleece here is gonna be for the foster buns room. So that was the rabbit rooms and the hamster cage and all of my Christmas decorations I already have. Now let's go ahead and head to the stores to get even more Christmas decorations. First stop, TJ Maxx. So TJ Maxx, all I got was this mug for $5. It says peace, love, joy. So I think I'm going to do Oreos tank kind of peanuts themed. I think that'd look really cute. So hopefully we can find some more peanuts things. Second stop, the Dollar Tree. All right, so we're done with the Dollar Tree. I spent about $10, so let's just do a quick car haul here. So we got some red wrapping paper, which has the peanuts on it. So this will match perfectly for the hamster's cage. Okay, then we got one thing. 
of red and silver garland. We actually got two of these. It's like blue and red and it's got snowmen on it. Then I got this Christmas tree dish, which I plan to use for Oreo. She'll basically have a Christmas themed sand bath. Then I got this little DIY LED paper house. I will not actually be using the LED. I'm just going to use the house. And I'm going to use this for Oreo's enclosure. I don't think she will eat this at all, so this should be safe. But I'm definitely going to keep an eye on it after I put this in her cage. Don't worry, because she really shouldn't be eating this material. But I think it'll look cute, and so we're going to try it. Then I got two gift bags, which has nothing to do with Christmas decorations. I just needed some more gift bags. Then we got a red bowl for the Foster's water. So it'll be nice and Christmas themed. And then the last thing we got here is another stocking. And this one says, have a holly jolly Christmas. So that's everything we got from Dollar Tree. Now I think we're going to head to Five Below and then PetSmart. So I'll see you there. We're now at Five Below. And then we'll be going to PetSmart. So we are back in the car once again. And so I'm gonna show you what I got at Five Below first. So I got this cute pet hut and it looks like a Christmas tree. So I'm gonna put this in one of the rabbit's rooms and they'll be definitely pretty cute. Hopefully they don't pee in it. Whenever I get these, they either rip them up or pee in them. But it was only $5, so we're gonna try that again. The other thing we got at Five Below was just some Oreo candy canes. I think I'm gonna hang these on the tree I plan on putting in the foster's room. And then of course I'm going to eat them as well. So that's what I got from Five Below. All right, then I went to PetSmart and they actually had some Christmas stuff. So we got a Christmas cat scratcher for like $5. Of course we're not gonna use catnip, but cat scratchers are great for rabbits. And it's got like candy cane theme on the side here. Then the next two products I was actually quite surprised to see inside PetSmart. So I got this Christmas colored like puff it's just made out of corn husks so this would be cute for the rabbits yeah i'll probably give that one to the rabbits and then i have holiday willow balls so i'll give some to the rabbits some to the hamster and yeah inside it looks like just paper so these are pretty cute they're obviously pretty small but the fact that they're red and green is pretty cool so that's everything i got from five below and PetSmart. and our next stop is going to be target Hopefully they have their holiday cat cardboard houses out so I can pick up one of those. All right, we're now at Target. All right, so we got the two cat houses. So I got the RV cat scratcher and I got the feeder one. So those are pretty cool. Okay, one of them was like $15, another was $17, so I will not plan on buying one, and then I bought two, so that's what happened. I'm sure both my rabbits are going to love them. Yeah. So our last and final stop is going to be Hobby Lobby. Final stop, Hobby Lobby. All right, so we just finished at Hobby Lobby, so we're gonna do another car haul. So the Dollar Tree didn't have any like window stickers, but I found some at Hobby Lobby and all their Christmas stuff was 50% off. So keep that in mind. This doesn't really have to do with decorating the hamster or the rabbit cages, but I got a cute pillow. And it says, have yourself a Merry Christmas. And this was $25, but 50% off. So it's like 12.50. I got a little ornament for our Christmas tree. It's a little dachshund in a sweater wrapped in lights. And this was $6.99, half off for $3.50. And it's got like glitter on his cheeks. It's cute. And then we got socks with dachshunds in bows. So that's cute. And the last thing we got is a sleigh. So this is like um, from their crafts section. And it was $3.99, half off, was only $2. But this is completely hamster safe, so 
There's no exposed glue, no nothing like that. So we're gonna put this in Oreo's cage and I think that's gonna look really cute. I'm obviously not gonna paint it. I'm just gonna leave it natural so it stays rabbit safe or hamster safe. I guess it's technically rabbit safe too. So that's everything from Hobby Lobby. Oh my goodness, we went to so many stores today. I've got so much Christmas stuff now to decorate. So I'm gonna end the video here. So if you wanna see me actually decorating the rabbit rooms and the hamster cage, make sure you stay tuned for my next upload. And if you like this video, make sure you leave us a like and I'll see you guys next time. And remember, live life to the fullest.